It's a sad day here in the Twin Tiers. Watkins Glen soccer player Devin Shaw died early this morning after a three-year battle with bone cancer. We'd like to flash back to 2010 when we first introduced you to Devin, a young man who exemplified courage, will, and strength, something the Twin Tiers will never forget. Well live every day like you can because you never know when it's going to be over. To live, to love, to play. In his first varsity game, just 50 seconds in, Watkins Glen's Devin Shaw scored a goal. But in just seconds, his life changed forever. In February, after what seemed like a routine knee injury, he was diagnosed with the aggressive bone cancer osteosarcoma. It took away his right knee and even worse, spread to his lung. At age 15, doctors say he'll never play soccer again. I didn't really know how to believe it because like everybody says, how could this happen to you? But it, until it actually does, you don't really know what it's like. The doctors and they told him that and he just broke down because that's his life. That's his love. After multiple surgeries and dropping to nearly 90 pounds, through tough physical exercises and chemotherapy treatments, Devin isn't breaking. He's fighting, fighting to walk again, fighting to survive. He's really strong. To be, I mean, I don't even know if I could do this. He knows it's not always going to be an easy road, but he's determined and uh, he knows that he's going to make this. He's not going to be defined by his illness. He's going to be defined by his resilience. It's required him to grow up really fast and to let go of certain parts of his dreams and then you know, pick up other ones. Let me be the man that I've always wanted to be. The outpouring of support has been like a dream, from Devin's day and Watkins to teammates shaving their own heads. All fuels the new dream. It just kind of opens your eyes. Well, I definitely want to get into coaching. In the long run, he's, he's always been wanting to be a coach. We're, we're looking forward to him getting better so he can be on the sidelines with us. I'd be really proud to have my kids or even myself play for him someday. One, two, three, take us! The team wears a message with pride for Devin. It's a message from the heart. Say it. Fight it. Cure it. Devin Shaw, a fighter forever. All right, Shaw leaves behind a legacy that shows people not only how to live, but how to stare in the face of adversity and be better because of it. In heaven, this is for you, my friend. I definitely want to get into coaching. Everybody says, how could this happen to you? But until it actually does, you don't really know what it's like. Every day like you can because you never know when it's going to be over. Well, thank you so much to Devin. You have taught us all how to live. We wanted to post some Facebook comments out there from our viewers. Chrissy Rexes says she'll miss his wonderful smile and positive spirit. Jenny Haley says the courage and strength of this young man is outstanding. Our town will be forever impacted by this young man. And DJ Locke says Devin emulates what it is to be a fighter and will always be and inspiration and uh, Devin thank you so much and uh, we're gonna miss you very very much and we love you very very much and uh, we're this band every day let's go to break <laughs> 